Thank you for purchasing the Sleep Safe 2 High Low Safety Bed. With proper care, your bed will provide years of safe use. Before we begin, we strongly recommend that this bed be assembled using two people. To begin, carefully unpack all the contents of your bed. Everything necessary to assemble your bed is included in a special box marked Additional Parts Inside, which is located in a box containing the headboard and footboard. However, one additional tool you will need is one 3 8 inch wrench. Be sure to save the four foam shipping blocks used to package the electric frame. They will be needed to aid in the assembly of your bed. Please take a moment and verify that all parts are included using the diagram shown on your screen. You may pause here if necessary. Now that you've verified that you indeed have all the necessary parts, let's begin. Step 1. Set the electric frame upright with foam spacer blocks underneath each corner of the mounting brackets as shown. Using the eight silver hex bolts, attach the side panels, item number four, to the brackets on the frame, but do not tighten the bolts completely. This allows freedom of movement for alignment purposes in the next step. Insert 12 barrel nuts, item number 14, into holes in each of the ends of the side panels. Be sure to align the barrel nut slot perpendicular to the edge of the panel. You may want to use a flathead screwdriver to help with the alignment. Step 2. Install the headboard and footboard to the side panels using 12 long allen bolts provided. The headboard and footboard will be elevated off the floor when installed. Tighten the allen bolts using the 4mm allen wrench, item number 10, provided in your hardware kit. Now, check the alignment of the decking on the electric frame at the headboard and footboard ends. Even up the spacing and tighten the eight hex bolts connecting the side panels to the frame installed during step one. Next, install the four casters, item number six, into the holes at the bottom of the headboard and footboard legs. You may need to tighten the caps on the casters for them to stay in place. You may now remove the foam spacers from underneath the frame. Step 3. Install the safety rails, item number 5, by inserting the black hex bolt pivot pins into the lower plastic strikes installed on each leg as you see here. The rails can then be tilted up into the locked position. The safety rails should be installed so that the clean side of the rails face the occupant of the bed when closed. The screws should be visible from the outside. Be sure to always remove and install safety rails while they're in the lowered position. Always check to be sure that the brass pins are locked in place to prevent the safety rail from opening unintentionally. And if all fits, then your Sleep Safe 2 High Low Safety Bed Assembly is complete.